Here in Greensboro, a close call after someone crashed into a business on Battleground Avenue. You can see the damage left behind at McKay's. Fortunately enough, the driver is okay and the business wasn't damaged enough that it had to close. WFMY News 2's Daniel Cruz spoke with one of the managers as cleanup began. As cars whiz by up and down Battleground Avenue, these unfamiliar plywood panels along the front of McKay's bookstore definitely catch your eye. I was the first manager to respond to uh, the incidents. Uh, I was actually sleeping when it happened. Joe Blondino is the assistant manager at McKay's Books and More in Greensboro. He says early Sunday morning he received a call that a car had smashed through the front of the store. Normally when you get a, uh, an alarm call like that, it's usually someone breaking in through the side door, but this is definitely the first uh, vehicular incident we've had. This was what one manager captured when they arrived at the store. You can see the car on the left side of the picture, the glass shattered. Books that once lined the wall scattered across the floor. Yeah, uh, no one got hurt um, at 3 3 in the morning, so no employees were here. The young man was also unfazed, so that's good. Luckily, the damage was confined to the purchase encounter, which did not open today. Although the rest of the store, things were business as usual. Blondino says that's the good news, since the weeks following Christmas are some of their busiest of the year. You would think the first week of Christmas would be the busiest week, but it's really the weeks after Christmas that are even busier. Kids are out of school, people have gift cards they want to spend, they have Christmas money they want to spend, so they all swap you know, the week after Christmas and just kind of swamp us and buy us all, all the cool stuff up. Blondino says the buying counter should reopen on Monday, and he's hopeful their unexpected New Year's remodel will be cleaned up and repaired later this week. Uh, we're waiting on the class people to get back to us, it being Sunday and New Year's. You know, there may be a couple days, but hopefully within the week we'll get this looking pretty again. Reporting in Greensboro, Daniel Cruz. <laughs> WFMY News 2.